Hey guys, so we're continuing our crusade to try to make Filipino food just slightly healthier so it's something that you can actually enjoy every day at the house. One of my favorite kind of Asian dishes that you find different variations of across Southeast Asia, the Philippines included, is a sticky rice. It's really kind of natural that sticky rice and rice flour have become kind of staples to make our desserts. It's not terrible for you. It all depends on the quantity you consume it in. So obviously you don't want to eat too much of it. White rice in general is basically rice that's been polished a lot of times. So if you want to be healthy about it, let's just use some brown rice. The problem with brown rice is that it's not as sticky. So obviously the consistency of this particular dish won't necessarily be as close as you want it to be to sticky rice, but it will satisfy you just the same. Again, all the ingredients and tools that we're using today are available at Landers. If you haven't been, it's absolutely massive and you should go soon, very soon. We're gonna start with the flavor. So, got some coconut milk right here. You use about half a cup, to which I'm gonna add about two tablespoons of my coconut sugar, pinch of cinnamon, and then a little bit of my vanilla essence. Mix all that together until you have something nice and sweet. You can always bring a little bit more dimension to the dish, by adding a little bit of my unsweetened almond milk. All we wanna do is bring that to boil until the mix thickens ever so slightly. My sauce is slightly thicker, brown rice has been cooked. We're gonna go ahead and add that. So like I said, it's not gonna be as sticky as your regular sticky rice. This rice is already slightly overcooked. Cook it down slightly further with this sauce so that everything kind of sticks together nicely. You'll see that most of the water has kind of evaporated out of it, and so you have this like nice clumpy rice, which is exactly what you want. So you don't have a separation of the liquid and the grains. At this point, you can actually cool it down or you can serve it right away. I actually like my mango sticky rice kind of warm when I eat it with a nice cold mango. Grab your nice fresh mango, scoop out all that beautiful sweet meat, and then we're just gonna transfer everything right on top here of our rice. Finish it with a little bit of my coconut sugar. And who said you couldn't have a dessert that is just slightly better for you, but it's also something you can eat every day. Try it out. Thank you so much for watching. And if you like that, make sure to check out all our other Landers videos and recipes that we've done with them. So we've done some top shots that are really cool. We're doing some more informational videos soon, just really talking about products, if they're good for you, if they're bad for you, where to get them. And yeah, so just a long, long year of content that we're developing with them. And as always, please make sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.